what's up guys hope you're all doing well this is going to be a quick unboxing i just want to share the um what is it the online harvard loafer from um ben silver collection that i got and i shipped down to america's cobbler which is jim mcfarlane mcfarlane shoe repair so let's dive right in and see how they came out one thing you can always count on with jim is that he he really does take pride in taking care of the shoes you know just as much as as i do which really means a lot to me because definitely like i enjoy wearing my shoes i don't mind if they show wear like that's what they're what they're made for but obviously i don't want them to develop signs of wear from shipping so it really means a lot when when the person that you're sending your shoes to and kind of trusting your shoes with kind of cares for them and takes as much time patience and energy to uh, Kind of deliver them better than they received them so obviously they are i'll link the actual unboxing of these um above this is the um crockett and jones harvard loafer which is in horween whiskey shell cordovan and uh, these were from ben silver collection and these were brand new when i sent them down to them i did wear them a few times in the house just to kind of make sure they were the right size set the creases kind of break them in and, and just be able to enjoy them a little bit before i sent them away but here is what we got back and these look really really nice so i requested the lulu toe plate the vibram explosion um half sole and the original leather heel i didn't want the rubber um top lift on this even though i always say that's the way i would go i think for this i really wanted to at least have some of the original leather outsole from Crockett and Jones and kind of see how that performed. But overall, you can really see the execution of this leather topi or the Vibram explosion is done extremely well. You can see, you know, when you look at it from the side profile here, it is tapered into the original sole very well. And just a, a beautiful job. I think one of the one of the easiest things to kind of um, get wrong here is either have this stop too short or go back too far. And if you look at it from right here, as well as the side profile, it's perfectly balanced and it's perfectly cut to fit right at the beginning of the waist so that you get, you know, the, sh the protection when your foot's actually striding on the ground, but it's not covering the entire, uh, you know, length of the outsole and it's perfectly kind of flushed in to the sole here as well. Hopefully that is coming through. So let's check out the other one real quick and I'll leave his links and contact information in the description here. And yep, this one is done just as cleanly, just as beautifully. Um, you know, this is definitely, definitely well worth, you know, the additional investment to protect the shoes, um, really just make them a little more bomb proof as far as wearing them in all conditions. And, um, you know, it's really important that you pick someone that you can trust with the shoes and someone that, you know, will do an extremely, extremely good and extremely clean job. So couldn't be, couldn't be happier with how these turned out and excited to actually really get to wear them for the first time. So thanks for watching. Let me know if you have any questions about reaching out to Jim or sending any work his way. Um, there's no kind of affiliate link or anything like that between Jim and I, just good friends and really really appreciate his dedication to the craft as well as just his skill and the fact that he is a straightforward honest shooting guy let me know if you have any questions about getting that set up otherwise thanks for watching i'll see you next time